delightful stay at our hotel. Thank you. <laughs> oh no, he's bowing! That is amazing. We have just come into Tokyo Disneyland and it is all themed for Christmas. There's Christmas songs playing at the moment. Going in was pretty easy. You had to collect your ticket from the station and show your QR code to get the actual like physical paper ticket. And then you just scan it in, go through, easy peasy, massive Christmas tree. Here. Wow. I've got my ears, ended up getting the sparkly pair. It's 1,700 yen. Hannah got the pink the fluffy pink ones. Fluffy. Yeah. And also got some earmuffs as well, which I'll show you later. They are currently redoing the castle. So it looks very um, modern 2019 right now. <laughs> <laughs> there it is in the distance. And it's also the Walt statue. In case you don't know Hannah, she is my best friend of 20 years, so basically my sister. And she is a seasoned Disney pro because <laughs> you've worked at Disney World for how long? It was first summer, so I did the yeah. Disney college program. And I watched too many Disney YouTube videos. Yeah, so I feel like Hannah is like the pro on this trip because I love Disney, but she loves it in a whole new level. And it's my first time at Tokyo Disney yeah. and, or Disney Sea, so. It's new for me as well. Yay! Well. Okay, we are gonna go, where are we gonna go now? To the restroom. To the restroom. <laughs> Pirates of the Caribbean was the first ride that we went on. Instructions were both given in Japanese and English, though during the ride it was mostly, if not all, in English. And by thunder, that scoundrel Captain Jack Sparrow will never be eyes on it. Nor this How did you think of the ride? It was really good. It was really fun. I love going on like different parts of the Caribbean. And in this one it felt like the beginning was longer. I know in like the Florida one at least you go down the slope and then you're like into the fiery bit whereas this was like they had like a longer bit and then it went fiery and it was all piratey and very good I, I like it we went into the enchanted tiki room a family-friendly show featuring animatronic singing birds volcano sound effects and a dancing stitch right at the end if you don't speak Japanese, you're also given an audio guide translating the storyline to follow along too. As soon as we came out, the parade was out in full swing. It was so cute seeing the little ones waving at the favourite characters and it was great to see how Disney is really brought to life, especially when you imagine it through their eyes. Oh, to be young again. We are now on Snow White's Adventures. <laughs> this ride's really scary. It is. <laughs> We decided to take a little detour for a few hours and we headed out of the park. The staff stamp your hand with an invisible stamp that only appears as Mickey Mouse when they shine their special torch on it. Magic. It's now lunchtime, so we've come over to their version of the Disney Springs and it's actually five floors here and four floors of different food and bars and restaurants and souvenir shops. And the one we've gone to is on the fourth floor, Chef's Row at Rossi's house. It's a more of a sit-down restaurant. The first floor is more of a fast food. Uh, quick service kind of meal. So I've gone for a garlic pula, which is steak with garlic rice over here. And Hannah's gone for a large bag bowl. It's not here yet, but it's a common. I made Hannah order a large so I can have some too. <laughs> Look at it sizzle. Oh no, sizzle. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. But it is really, really busy in Disney today. It's Sunday. Yeah. It's a public holiday yesterday, so there's a lot of kids, a lot of families. So it, yeah, it's good to kind of like, we're like, we'll come away and yeah. eat and like, then go back later when the kids aren't there. We're eating and drinking in the meantime. Until the kids are away. Then we go out and play. A portion of Shiraz and some sparkling wine later, we headed back into the park to find that it was a lot less busy compared to the crowds a few hours ago. She and Hannah went to take you to Disneyland after a couple of hours of avoiding the crowds and hiding in a bar that had happy hour. Come in hither and join us. Da -da 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 -da. The magical celebration that is Disneyland. It's actually more fun in the evening, so we left for four hours and then we're back. <laughs> This is a 
great parade, but this is the most catchy and annoying jingle that will play in your mind for the next four or five hours. Going on Jungle Cruise, Japanese version. We're basically walking onto the ride because everyone's gone home. Jungle Cruise is all in Japanese. <laughs> We are now queuing up for the Haunted Mansion. It's a 20 minute wait to walk it past his pumpkins and it makes me really want to celebrate Halloween. Next stop, Star Tours. I remembered this from Florida and though everything was in Japanese, it was still undeniably a great ride, especially if you enjoy 3D adventures. Word of warning though, if you have a sensitive stomach, you may feel nauseous and casting from the jerky movements of this ride. The final ride of the day was Big Thunder Mountain, one of my favourite rides at Disney along with Space Mountain. We've been on this during the day at Disney World before, but I've always preferred it in the evening and it's a great one to end the night on. We are now in the home store and everything is so cute. Look at this burger. What is this? It's a Mickey Mouse shaped burger cushion. I've got a little bow one as well. Apparently this is all the rage because the hand Spencer um, squirts out Mickey shaped foam. You know you're in an Asian Disney store when they have the um, scoop, rice scoop thing. Look. <laughs> In different Disney formats. That is so cool. And I also really want one for my rice cooker. And look, extra long chopsticks for when you're cooking. It's happening. We're about to check in with dinosaurs. I don't even know what to expect. <gasps> He's moving. Hi. He's all right. Oh my goodness, it's actually. <laughs> They're awake. <laughs> <laughs> <Just like laughs> Give me two ah. Okay, we need to now scan our passport and he's going to make sure that we are checked in. Oh no, he's really concentrating. Oh, I don't like staring at me. I will now register the state guest information. Okay. Please press the button to begin. <laughs> How many holidays do you get a year? They've just printed out our room key. Thank you. Arigato gozaimasu. Your check-in is now completed. Please carry on to the elevator in order to reach your room. Okay. Enjoy the whiteful stay at our hotel. Thank you. <laughs> oh, no, he's bowing. That is amazing. Wow. We also have a robot fish swimming in the tank. He wasn't there earlier, so he must have been taking a break or something. Hiya! Ooh! Wow! Though the hotel is mostly manned by the dinosaurs, human staff are still at hand if you need something specific, like storing luggage or ordering a taxi to the airport. They're just hidden right at the back. This is our room. We have three single beds. This is my little ramen bag. And they give you pyjamas. Basically every hotel we've stayed at have given us pyjamas and we couldn't be happier. It's a pretty basic but good room, especially for sharing with some friends. So over here is Hannah's demonstrating our wardrobe. And we've got a sink here. What does our bathroom look like? Oh, very nice, yeah. Hannah, I don't think you're gonna fit in the bath, but you know, I thought that counts. <laughs> Classic. Pretty good. And good thing is, tomorrow we're going to Disney Sea, and they've already arranged our pickup and our transfer tomorrow and sent it over to the hotel, so we know. Find this, tell police. <laughs> yeah, if we, if we don't see this vlog, we know it was the check-in. T-Rex. Were they even T-Rex? They weren't T-Rex. They were like they the... They were raptors. Yeah, raptors. They were like the scary ones that run really fast and they're like... Bleh! I genuinely feel like in the middle of the night they're probably going to brainwash us and tomorrow we're going to be suddenly transformed into dinosaurs and work here now. What do you think, Hannah? 
I'm okay with that. Final thoughts on Tokyo Disneyland. I don't think I liked it as much as I love Disney World, but Disney World is on another level. It was very, very busy, but that's partly because it was on a Sunday. Yesterday was also a bank holiday, so there were a lot of kids around, and I thought, I think we both thought it was so much more fun when we went in the evening, and it looked so much cooler in the evening with all the lights and stuff as well, because during the day, it really felt like it was from the 80s, like everything looked a little bit faded, a bit old, and it wasn't until the evening that I felt a bit more magical, in my opinion. Hannah, what do you think? Um, yeah, no, it's the same. It's like difficult, to, you can't really compare it to Disney World, but um, yeah, it was really busy, and they were doing a lot of construction, but yeah, the evening definitely was more magical. Yeah, but I'm excited to see Disney Sea tomorrow, because that's brand new and exclusive to Tokyo, right? Yeah. Bid you farewell, I'm going to make myself some noodles and then I'll see you in the morning for Disney Sea. Good night. Good night. The next and final Japan vlog will be all about Disney Sea, which we personally enjoyed a lot more. So I'll see you then. Thank you for watching.